If you measure the position of the electron in the atom for the lowest energy level, most of the time you're going to find the electron, once you measure it, hanging out somewhere around the Bohr radius. The maximum, most likely probability is here. But there is a chance that it's closer to the nucleus, but notice how the probability falls off and approaches zero. But actually, interestingly, it doesn't actually ever get to zero. So there is a small chance the electron can be in the nucleus, which is weird. Very, very small chance, but it's, it's, it's there. But but look at what's even weirder than that. There's a probability that the electron will exist at some arbitrary distance away from the nucleus. That means that if I have an atom here, there's actually a chance that the electron around this atom is not here, but over like at the end of the solar system or around another star, because this does not get, does not actually go to zero. Because if you look at this, e to the r, if I put r as a, as a really, really big number far away from the nucleus, that just makes this one over a big number. It just makes the probability really small, but it never gets to zero. So there's a non-zero chance that the electron around my finger here is actually around, you know, Alpha Centauri somewhere really far away, but it's a very, very small probability. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.